Sundance Film Festival is spinning out of Utah this year, dropping independent films into theaters across the country, including a theater in Denver that has been closed for most of the last year. Here's Byron Reed with that. It's been a great opportunity for us. Matthew Campbell is feeling optimistic these days about people coming back to theaters to see movies. To have a little taste of going back out and doing that and seeing some fun, exciting films the day that they premiere. He's the artistic director for Denver Film, a local nonprofit that runs and owns the C Film Center on Colfax. Usually it'd be open seven days a week, showing theatrical titles in addition to a lot of uh, specialty programming and film festivals that we do. Like most independent movie venues across the country, the film center was forced to close their doors due to the pandemic. We closed back in the end of March, beginning of April. But recently, the film center received good news when the Sundance Film Festival made an announcement. The Utah-based IndieFest will be showing their films virtually by producing satellite screenings at 20 screenhouses across the country. We've tried to create a schedule of films that really speaks to our community and to create a program specific to the Denver audience. The C Film Center is the only theater in the state to host the event, and moviegoers will be socially distanced. What we're selling is basically a private rental or a pod screening for you and nine of your closest friends, family. The screenings will run for seven days and groups will be required to rent out the entire theater for $600. We have 12 films in the program. Um, we'll start screening this coming Friday through uh, the following Tuesday. The goal is to help independent theaters across the country feel hopeful. We get all the proceeds of the tickets that we sell. And keep the Sundance tradition alive on the big screen. This just to get the word out to remind people like, hey, you know, theaters are still relevant. We're still here. For next. So hopefully it'll just get people excited to return to the theater again. I'm Byron Reed. It's been a long time for a lot of folks. So in addition to renting out the theaters for private viewing, the film center's also gotten by with a PPP loan last year and some grants from the new stimulus package.